Here at Hawk Designs, we've built a lot of custom Jeeps over the years. We've used Bilstein 5100 series shocks on a lot of those builds. When the opportunity presented itself to build them a custom vehicle for the use in their promotion, we jumped at the opportunity. So Bilstein is a premium supplier for shock absorbers. We're a tier one supplier to all the major OE um, car manufacturers. We are located in Germany, so a lot of our focus comes uh, from the German development team, but we also have a big team in the US. I'm here today because we're going to build a super exciting vehicle. Unimog is for us the ideal base for this kind of thing because Mercedes-Benz is our biggest customer. And so we took a car which fits us very well, but is also very exciting. And well, let's see what we'll do with it. We're looking to connect with our customers. So we're looking for a rolling showcase that can not only celebrate our heritage of our brand, but also incorporate new technology into Bilstein uh, shock absorbers. We want to do something that no one else has done and that's why we've come to Kenny Hawk. Kenny always uh, has some really awesome builds and we thought it'd be really awesome to have a really unique, really capable vehicle that would really turn some heads out there on the trail. So here we are and we can't wait to see how this thing turns out. We decided to use a DOCA 416 Mercedes Unimog as the basis of the project that we're going to build for Bill Science Suspension. We're going to modernize this Mercedes Unimog by getting rid of the dated, worn out interior and upgrading the external lighting, as well as making it more off-road capable by upgrading the suspension and a lot of other cool tricks. So Jake, what do you think of the old Unimog? Man, it's my first time in a Mercedes, but I am in love with this thing. <laughs> I'm telling you, this is a rare one. A Doka 416 is a four-door hardtop Unimog they only built a few hundred of these things. It's really cool, it's very unique, it's German engineering at its finest, but this thing is outdated. Mm -hmm. We're gonna go ahead and put a full Bilstein suspension on it. We're gonna upgrade the bumpers front and rear. We're gonna add worn wenches. We're gonna repair all the rust, do a full paint job on this thing, and then we're gonna do lots of cool little touches all over it to bring it into the modern era. I'll tell you what, when that thing came in, I was super pumped. I didn't know exactly what we were getting into. To take it rock crawling though is completely different than what it was designed for. There's no doubt in my mind, um, Bill Stein working with Kenny Hawk on this build and it being a Unimog and us paired together, that this will be probably one of the most epic builds you will see this year. We chose Kenny because he's a customer of ours number one uh, and he has produced some of the meanest vehicles out there that gets a lot of attention uh, and he does it the right way. You know, part of Bill Stein's quality is lasting so long. And Kenny builds products and builds vehicles the right way, so we feel that Kenny will build this to the quality standards that Bill Stein is accustomed to. All right, Jake, so I think the first thing we're gonna do is go ahead and ship off everything we're not gonna use. So fenders, bumpers, the old fuel cell, the interior should be stripped. That way we can expose all the rust and start cutting it out and replacing it with new metal. I'm ready to rip into it. Ready to do it? Let's do it. So the more we started stripping parts, the more rust we were able to find. The floors were rough, the roof was rough, and everything in between. So now it's gonna come down to doing a lot of metal work before we can even start body work. Bilstein is known for building high quality suspension components. We're honored to have the opportunity to build them a show vehicle worthy of the Bilstein name. So we want to again connect to the people. We want to be at all the good festivals with it. And we, for that we need a vehicle that actually can work well and that represents the brand well. And we're hoping to get that done. 